Welcome to I Heart Reviewing Stuff. So I have a package uh, that just arrived uh, this morning from Claire's. Um, so I have the new uh, Series 3 mini brands. I did hear uh, from friends uh, that I think I've already opened these and gotten a look at the checklist. But I guess there is some overlap with Series 2 Wave 2. Uh, so I'm hoping I don't get, uh, any dupes. It says a hundred plus to collect, which is a little odd for a first wave of a series to say. So I think that's why, um, it says it on here. So I don't, I'm a little confused with these. I don't know if there's going to be like a wave two to these, um, or if maybe this is like a Claire's thing. And maybe when they go to Walmart and Target, maybe this number will change because maybe they won't put in the Series 2 Wave 2 ones. Uh, so these are recommended for age 3 plus. Uh, and then I made a little bracelet for my ground cinnamon uh, mini brand. Uh, these are a little trickier than some other toys to get my little like uh, jewelry hook screw thing in. I forget what they're called. Um, uh so I usually have to use, I use like a thumbtack to kind of start, make the hole, and then I can get the little, um, eyelet thing or whatever they call it in there. So then I can put the string and then do the beads. Uh, so I made the ground cinnamon one for myself. I do make a lot of mostly necklaces, but you can ask for bracelets if you prefer for the Misha's toy jewels. Uh, that I have on Instagram and I charge $15 uh, per necklace. Um, if you want a bracelet, I usually make you an extra bracelet with the same bead pattern, uh, but just one of the two bracelets will have the toy on it that you wanted. Um, so I still charge $15, uh, but $5 goes to my local food bank. Um, and the $10 Honestly, it's like $5 easily to ship uh, even just one like necklace or bracelet to somebody. Uh, so I figure like that takes half of that $10 remaining and then the $10 remaining kind of covers the cost of like uh, supplies that I buy. Because I would say like um, beads and the toys that I use are probably the more uh, pricey thing. String is pretty cheap and the little screw hook things that I use are cheap um as well so yeah these are $12.99 uh I'm thinking when Walmart and Target get them it'll be the $6.99 hopefully uh I'm not quite sure why they decided to make the Gold Rush ones $9.99 uh at Target um because I don't know we bought two I was a little bummed we got a gold basket in both of ours because I would prefer just to get like five uh, minis. Um, so I don't know with this one if I'm getting, I don't hear a lot rattling in there, but some of times there are like boxes or um, little like plastic bags of stuff. So let's go ahead and see what we get so I have time to show the checklist. So it's silver wrapping, but it looks like it's a white ball underneath that. Oops, I didn't quite get the zipper all the way. So I'm hoping these will be cheaper when they come to Walmart and Target. And hopefully maybe the amount will change. I want to say the first waves usually have 60 to 70 to collect. And then I thought for wave two of this, it said like 130 plus in the series two ones. So these open like an orange. Uh, all right, so I think this has a checklist, so I'm going to open that one first, and oh, okay, I've seen other people get this one, it's like craft singles, um, it's cool that it actually looks, uh, just like you would get at the store, um, American sliced cheese, I think this is the kind, of, like, orange cheese that's good on, like, grilled cheese sandwiches, and it's funny, it even has, like, nutrition facts, uh, on there. Uh, so that's cool that it looks just like in the store. Okay, so let's take a look at this checklist. And I'm not probably going to know exactly which ones are repeated. So there's like six golds, it looks like, and then like five glow in the dark. 
those all look new to me. They don't, they don't look like repeats. Uh, then there's some metallics, which I also don't think they've already been done uh, in metallic. And then there's uh, quite a bit of candy in this uh, series. So there's some common candies. And then there's kind of a variety of stuff um, that I'll show there, like Hershey syrup, Icy, but then like Teddy Grahams. Uh, so luckily, uh, quite a bit, I think, is new. Um, not sure about those Blue, Dol Blue Diamond Almonds, because uh, they've done different flavors in those, so I don't know. Oh, the Sweethearts. Uh, cutie pie like those heart candies that's cool i did see somebody got the animal crackers okay ah. so start up here um what is this there's a cool whip i don't know if it's the same as they've done before with cool whip um i feel like that baker's chocolate box has already gotten put out before um I definitely know this blue bottle of Kool-Aid, which is a cool one to get, but I'm hoping I don't because <laughs> um, I already have it. And there's a Kool-Aid Jammers, which I, I know they did that in metallic, so I'm not sure. The stove top and shake and bakes. Again, I don't know if it's repeated because they've done different flavors. Uh, there's like a blue cheese baby veil. I know they've done uh, the red one before. The Laughing Cow looks familiar, both of the Laughing Cow things. Uh, there's a Mike and Ike, and there's some like guacamole. That's cool. The Mentos is cool. Uh, and then there's like a, some Dum Dums, the lollipops. Uh, the diapers and training pants look like repeats to me. So I'm not really sure why they chose the things they chose. I don't even know what number 101 and 102 are uh and then there's the bags and the two baskets look the same to me the shelves uh but there is i would say number 106 107 and 108 look like new items um i'm not super into the building things uh but marissa does like to use them for like pretend play with her uh, dolls. Okay, so I think this is a new one. Uh, it's Crystal Light Wild Strawberry. I feel like they've only done this in Lemonade. And I like the size. Um, the only thing with getting the dupes when they are um, in plastic, like the craft uh, cheese slices, or when they're boxes like this, um, I don't really know. I just usually try to find homes for those dupes because I don't really know how I would tackle turning that into a um, necklace or bracelet. This is a cool one. Icy Squeeze Candy Blue Raspberry. So that seems like a very sugary, make sure you brush your teeth after eating, but that looks yummy. Okay, so I think I'm down to two left. Oh, bags. <laughs> I feel like I've gotten bags uh, quite a bit, but again, I can give them uh, to Marissa to play with. So let's see, I got one more left. Ooh. Oh, cool, a candy one. Reese's peanut butter cups, like in a bag, the like two pack. And it's really cool how you can like feel and it'll feel like something's actually in there. Um, I don't know what they put inside because I don't. If I had a dupe, I don't know, I usually try to give my dupes to homes that need them. So I'm, I see other people though, that will like, just go ahead and like see, I guess, you know, curiosity, they'll see what's inside. Um, I just, I don't really like to destroy a toy. <laughs> um, so yeah, really cool. So I would say, hmm, what's my favorite? This is probably my favorite because I do like the hard plastic ones the most. So that's probably my favorite of the ones I got today. And then probably the Reese's Peanut Butter Cups because I did really want a candy one. I guess I have two candies. Even though when I think icy, I don't really think of candy. I think of like the drink. Um, so this still just makes me think like when this be some the syrup that you're like squeezing onto your 
uh, shaved ice. <laughs> um, the cheese would probably be my third favorite. And then I would say uh, the crystal light. But let me look at the checklist again real quick just to see. So let's see here. So the guacamole comes in a gold, the icy, and then chocolate or strawberry Hershey syrup, ice breakers. And I can't quite actually make out what this one is. It looks like maybe hmm, some kind of candy one, but I, I'll have to try to find its original of where it's at. Uh, let me look here real quick. So metallic, it looks like the there's a Hershey syrup also in metallic. And then there's wheat thins. I ate those. Oh, okay. So this might actually have a metallic version, I think, but I didn't get the metallic. Uh, cookies and cream, Hershey, apple pie spice, and a royal. It's like an instant pudding, I think. I only know of really the Jello brand. Um, let's see. Jolly Rancher, York Peppermint Patties, the Heath Bar. Reese's Pieces, but okay, so some stuff, let me tell you guys also, some stuff has, there's going to be like a Mini Mart exclusive, so that's kind of like the stores that they make. I did see they've done, there was like a Series 1 store, and then I did see at Target like a Series 2 store, so this must be going to have a Series 3 kind of like Mini Mart store. It also says there's going to be like a 24 pack exclusive. So those have like blue stars by them. Uh, oh, okay. So it looks like the spicy guacamole would be only in that mini mart store. Oh, and then the ones, let me see. I'll, let me explain the ones that have the pink behind them. Those are collector's case exclusive, which a friend did send me the link, but I didn't buy it. I'll probably regret that I did it. Um, she sent me, it was on Amazon $9.99, I think to release this month, I think like July, it was like mid-July, I think, like maybe July 15th or so. Um, so the collector's case, you're going to get a like emoji Pez, you're going to get a Mentos pink thing of gum, I don't know what flavor that is, uh, get honey made chocolate graham crackers, looks like grape nuts, uh, that's drumstick, but it looks like that stripey gum. Uh, but I don't know what candy this is. <laughs> um, let's see. So I guess you get five, which I think sometimes they usually only came with four, I thought, in the uh, collector case. So yeah, that was only $9.99 on Amazon. Um, hopefully when it gets closer to the release, maybe they'll get some more uh, in. And then there are let me see. Super rares are the golds, and rares are the metallics, and the glow-in-the-darks. All right, so I think that's everything uh, to go over. Um, it's just beware, like, if you see, like, little symbols, usually that means, like, you're not going to get them in the ball. So that's also a thing to, like, factor in. Um, it's cool. I don't know if they've ever done this 24-pack exclusive before. Let me see how many on the checklist even have the star real quick and then I'll end. Nothing on that side. So the gold icebreakers, I guess, is going to be, and a glow-in-the-dark royal something. Kind of looks like ice cream, maybe. You'll get a metallic uh, in the 24-pack. Two of these candies. Triscuits crackers. So how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. So I think they're only showing you six. So I don't know what the other 18 would be, I think. <laughs> All right, so cool. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And I do have one more, but I'm going to let Marissa open that. This one has a lot more rattling going on. So she might actually look out and get all like mini brands because that's what I usually I try to shake them for honestly I usually don't really want the building stuff or the bags or anything I usually just want five uh mini brands but at least I'm happy I don't have any of these four uh, so I didn't get any repeats from uh 
wave two of series two. Oh yeah, those hot dogs look familiar. So yeah, just beware of that. Um, you uh, might want to hold out, but if you're impatient like me, you know, don't don't worry about it. We a lot of us are. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Bye.